So where have I been for the past year? Josh, why, where the fuck have you been? Where did the videos go? What happened to b -side? Why haven't you been uploading? What the fuck is wrong you don't with go you? Out I missed the video. You, fell you off. already It's peaked. been an entire fucking year, Josh. Get your shit together. What the fuck happened to you? Stop. I just took a break. No biggie. <laughs> I fucking love my life. But it hasn't always been like this. Listen close. My entire life, I've had a bunch of fucking old people telling me to go to school. Go to school. Get good grades, stay in line, know your place, follow the rules. Don't break the fucking rules. Don't have too much fun, don't take risks, don't do stupid shit. Don't do stupid shit. Okay, I get it. But stupid things have good outcomes all the time. Look over there, and you guys are look, come on, look. Oh my god. Oh man. Can you follow me, please? <laughs> I'm barely 18. Let me act my fucking age. Let me make mistakes because the greatest mistake that anyone can ever make is being afraid to make another but one. But this movie isn't about me. No, it's not. I could be 24, 35, 51. The, the point you, is, bro? f*** that shitty f***ing advice you've been forced to swallow ever since you were born. Break the fucking rules. Have as much fun as you can. Take risks. Be young. And do stupid shit because in the end, we'll only regret the chances you didn't take. And the fucking truth is that you aren't remembered for the shit that you don't do and the rules that you don't break, but for the ones that you do. So grow a fucking pair of balls and live a little. You're going to get judged. You're going to be talked about. <laughs> Mikey, Alexis, Cynthia, Vale. Um, wait, 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 there's more. There's more. There's more people. There's more people. Um, uh, fucking half the grade. Hold up. Um, um <laughs> you get the point. You're gonna get judged. You're going to be looked at differently just because you decide not to do things like every other fucking person. <laughs> But God forbid I dare say it. You decide to do things that no one else does. What the fuck am I doing with my life? What the fuck? What the fuck am I even? What the fuck am I even doing? It's your fucking life, so don't let anyone make you feel guilty room. for it. So live how you want, do what you want, and do what you can. Today is July 20th, 2022. And I guess I just set the camera up to make me feel a little better. Even if I'm not filming for anything. I probably will never make a video like this ever again. When I tell you that I've looked at every single individual frame in this video, I've looked through every single individual frame in this video. If I had known it would have taken this much work and this much time and this much sacrifice and this much everything to make this, if I had known, I would have never done it. But Fuck, I needed, I needed, I needed it. If it wasn't for this, if it wasn't for having to be out of my comfort zone and having to do so many different things, I would have never, ever, ever met the amazing people I've met this year. I would have never done any of the, I literally went to fucking Peru alone a couple days ago. I would have never done that, never. And I guess this is why I do it. This is why, because this is what I want to do. I, I fucking love this, it makes me, so happy. It's our fucking time. It's our time to disrupt the cycle and to paint all over those fucking white walls. It's our fucking time. Ah, it's our fucking time. We only have one life left to live, so. Be you. Be unapologetically yourself. Live your life with enthusiasm because life has so much to fucking offer. And you have way too many dreams, aspirations, and ambitions left to chase. You have too many bucket list items left to do. We only have one life left to live. Just one. So why aren't we running like we're on fucking fire towards our wildest dreams? Go wake up at 4 a.m. Pack your bags and go on a road trip with your best friends. Blast your favorite music on the way there. Fuck sleep. Watch the 
a gorgeous sunrise. Fuck it, go in the water. And go get breakfast because those conversations are gonna be some of the best ones you are ever going to have. After that, go to an amusement park. Face you for your roller coasters. And while you're at it, face you for your heights too. You ain't flying. Get on a fucking plane. Who cares if it's to Cancun or Toronto or Cincinnati or Dallas? Travel. Go to New York and Turkey and Sicily. When you get back, have a little me time. Have a spa day, read a new book, learn a new skill. So then go pick up your friends and go to a beach cleanup. Play forfeit mini golf. And loser has to jump into a dirty ass fountain. Bridge jump. Drop your phone in the water and get a job so you can buy yourself a new one. Film your first vlog. Go to an escape room. Prank your friends. Prank your teacher. Or after that, get lunch. Or have a picnic on the beach. And go on a boat. Get a tattoo. Then fuck it. Make it on the news. Why not try thrifting? You might just find some dope shit. looks like George Washington. <laughs> You look like a founding father. You look like a founding father. You're on my quarter. Juice, juice. I got the drop on you. <laughs> I think someone's like funeral clothes. <laughs> oh my god. Toronto. <laughs> no. <laughs> like in the vault. You're a menace, dude. I can't take this. It's a little fashion statement. Yeah, let's put it back. It's a new trend. It's a new trend. Update, we bought it. Have a good time all the time. But hey. Wait, that's not possible. Get embarrassed first game of the season. Fail a couple tests, have a mental breakdown, get into a car accident, another mental breakdown, another car accident, have a couple pregnancy scares. Okay, that's a little too stupid, but lose a couple friends, get super sick, get kicked out of your house, end up in the hospital. What do you want to say to your future self? Uh, you're being an idiot right now. Stop being worried so much. This guy is a fucking dumb. Walk out of school with your friends and get caught. Then argue about it with your shitty fucking assistant principal. But still get a referral and get suspended while all of your senior activities are taken away. Whatever. That's life. You need the bad shit to happen to be able to fully appreciate the good. So get kicked out of a party and have a random ass photo shoot. Spontaneously go fishing, catch a fucking alligator. Yeah, this is so awesome. Ride a fucking mechanical bull and eat shit. I think I broke my arm. <laughs> <laughs> I think I broke my arm. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna eat shit in 0.2 seconds. Like that! Oh, shit! <laughs> <laughs> you went hard on me, bro. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, we're gonna eat fuck. Yeah! <laughs> Yo, make it turn around. <laughs> yeah, I see it right there! I think I love you. I think I love you. Let it fuck out. 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 Yo, we gotta get some pussy tonight. <laughs> Find a lost dog, return at home. Try all the food you can find. The best, the worst, the world's hottest wings, the world's hottest chips. Explore all the abandoned buildings you can. Encounter real ghosts. Get a stupid haircut and surprise your friends. Make a song, start a band. Have a terrible dance off or a holiday competition. Have a potluck or go eat out. After dinner, get dessert. Make friends with the owner. But sneak into a super nice hotel. Skinny dip, hitchhike, and get pulled over. And whatever you do, don't run from the fucking car. And then get pranked on your own vlog. Oh, then go to a game or a concert or a festival. Then meet some people along the way. Party a little, party a lot. This is Go to some famous guy's party, grab a mic, get on stage and act like you fucking own the place. Crowd surf, car surf. Get some late night munch and have a fat ass sleepover with all your best friends. Fuck it, watch movies till dawn and jump in the pool at 5 a.m. just because you can. Take a rest day if you're a bitch, get canceled, and do it all again. Take your life and make it the best story in the world and chase your dreams a little bit more every day because you only live one. Once. And if you do it right, once is enough. That's forever. I'm going crazy. Well, sometimes when you're editing, you just gotta take a little break and dance. Because if I'm being honest, it does get lonely sometimes, and it's pretty hard, and it is stressing. So yeah. Love you.